For today's video, we will answer a math challenge given by one of our followers. And the question goes like this. Solve for the real value of x. Given x raised to the power of x equals x raised to 2023. Now you can pause this video if you want to give this problem a try. And now, let's answer this question together. So, our goal here is to solve for the real value of x that satisfies this equation x raised to the power of x equals x raised to the power of 2023. Now, an obvious answer here is, of course, x equals 2023 because if we replace all x with 2023, then we have 2023 raised to 2023 equals 2023 raised to 2023. They are equal, they are balanced. Therefore, an obvious answer, x equals 2023. But the question is, is this the only solution? So now, let's focus first on this equation, x raised to the power of x equals x raised to 2000. Now, what we're going to do here is to divide both sides by x raised to 2023. Now, why we do that? Because here we go x raised to 2023 over x raised to 2023 cancel out cancel out so the right hand side is just equal to 1. Now let's use some loss of exponent on the left hand side because take note we have the same base right here. So now take note when we have b raised to the power of a divided by b raised to the power of c we have the same base but different exponent it must be equal to b raised to the power of a minus c. Therefore, the left-hand side of our equation can be written as x raised to the power of x minus 2023. Now, the right-hand side is just 1. So, what is the value of x that makes this left-hand side, x raised to the power of x minus 2023, equal 1? So one thing is, why not? Let's try x equals 1. So now let's replace all x with 1. And let's check. So we have 1. This x becomes 1 right here. And this x becomes 1 right here. Now 1 minus 2023, this will give us negative 2022. Now to make this exponent a positive number, what we're going to do is to take the reciprocal of this number. So the left-hand side must be equal to 1 over 1 raised to 2022. Now 1 raised to 2022 simplifies into 1. So we have 1 over 1 and 1 over 1 is just 1. Therefore, another value of x that satisfies this equation is when x equals 1. So we have 2 now. We have 2023 and we have x equals 1. Now, the third value of x, let's see, why not try x equals negative 1? So, let's see. If we replace all x with negative 1, so this x becomes negative 1 right here, this x becomes negative 1 right here also. Now, let's simplify. Negative 1 minus 2023, this will give us negative 2024. Again, to make this exponent a positive number, let's take the reciprocal of this number. So the left-hand side becomes 1 over negative 1 raised to the power of 2024. Now, negative 1 raised to an even exponent, this becomes a positive 1. Therefore, the left-hand side is just 1 over 1. And 1 over 1 again is just 1. Therefore, x equals negative 1 is also part of our solution. So, given this equation, x raised to the power of x equals x raised to 2023, then the values of x that satisfies this equation must be x equals positive or negative 1 or x equals 2023. And that is the answer to this question. And as always, we are done.